Hello, this is another video tutorial on how to use PHTAT and finding the measures of variation such as range, variance, standard deviation, and coefficient of variation. Now, supposing we want to compare the uh, variability of the age values of female participants and the age of male participants in this data set. And since uh, the uh, data does not show that the uh, age are not separated yet to a female and female participants, we must unstack the values first or uh, separate the age of female from the age of male participants. To start with, we uh, click add-ins, then choose ph dot, choose data preparation, then unstock data. Under the grouping variable cell range, highlight the sex column. Then, under the stock data cell range, highlight the age column. Check this box first cells in both ranges contain label then click ok now we have separated the uh, age of uh, male participants from the age of female participants the numerical code 0 represents male participants so we change this to male and then 1 represents female participants now, we can now take or find the uh, measures of variation in terms of range, variance, and standard deviation. So, uh, we click PH dot, then choose descriptive statistics, then descriptive summary. Under raw data cell range, highlight the two columns or the column of male and female values. After which, check this box and then instead of single group variable choose multiple groups and stack then click ok now this is the results the uh, descriptive summary includes mean median mode and uh, the measures of uh, variation such as range variance standard deviation and coefficient of variation Looking at the values, it shows that um, the uh, variance and the standard deviation of the uh, age of male participants are greater than the variance and the uh, standard deviation of the age of female participants. Thus, this gives us a conclusion that the uh, variable, or rather the set that is more variable, is the uh, set of the uh, age values of the male participants or again um, the age of male participants is uh, more variable than the age of the female participants now let's go back to the uh, original data now what if we want to compare the uh, variability between the uh, weight of the participants and the height of the participants that's the best measure of variability to compare which that is more variable is the coefficient of variation why coefficient of variation since the two sets have different units we are comparing the variability of the two sets which are expressed in different units weight is expressed in kilograms while height is expressed in feet. So, again, we uh, click add-ins, choose PH dot, then descriptive statistics and descriptive summary. Since uh, we are comparing the variability of these two variables, weight and height, highlight the two columns, then click this box and instead of single group variable since 
we are comparing two different uh, variables choose multiple groups and stack then click ok so we have this result instead of using the uh, standard deviation in comparing the variabilities of the two sets we must compare the coefficient of variation since again the two sets have different units the coefficient of variation for the weight is 18.2 percent while for the height is 10.11 percent remember that the coefficient of variation is also equal to the mean divided by the standard deviation or rather excuse me standard deviation divided by the mean which is 9.5690 divided by 53.09 and in the other set it is 0.54 divided by 5.416 thus we have 18.02 percent for the coefficient of variation for the weight and 10.11 percent for the coefficient of variation for the height now which set is more variable now since uh, the coefficient of variation for the weight is greater than the coefficient of variation for the height this uh, gives us or leads us to a conclusion that the set that is more variable is the uh, weight where the coefficient of variation is 18.02 percent so this ends my tutorial in uh, finding the uh, measures of variation using pH tag. Thank you.